Hey everyone, this is Squallsnake, Editor-in-Chief of MyGamer.com, and today I am playing Pretty Girls Breakers with an exclamation point on PS4. This is the very first time I am playing this game. I've been playing the Pretty Girls games on PlayStation 4. I've been covering them here, right here on my channel. been reviewing them, streaming them, and I just kind of like their simple approach. And... I just read this on the options menu, so I don't need to read it here. I think I'm okay. And let's get started. So some type of a Brickles, you know, single player Pong clone. Oh, you got a swing. Okay, that's interesting. And you could follow me on Twitter at Zach Gaz, Z A C K G A Z. Oh man, this is taking. Okay, I gotta figure this out. This is, uh,. It's a new spin on the Brickles format because you have to swing like a baseball bat. Okay, I got a barrier power up. Arkanoid is another one. Arkanoid, do it again. Great game on Super Nintendo. Go check that out. Has co op, has a bunch of bonus items to get, you know, superpowers and things. Really cool Brickles game there. And apparently, when you beat this stage, I guess we'll find out if I can beat this, you unlock a new outfit for the girls, which is just what this so pretty girls genre, or series, I guess I should say, it's not a genre, geez, series of games. Yeah, you kind of have to time your weird because she's lefty you know, swinging kind of like Link and Link to the past his sword where it kind of goes above his whole body he swings in front of him you know completely yeah so if you want to hit it to the right you kind of have to you got to swing early uh, yeah, there you go. So if you, I guess if you hit it at the right time, you get like that super shot. This is always the problem with these kind of Brickles games is like when you get the one or two bro blocks left, you can't hit them. It takes a lot of aiming and trial and error. Uh, oh, I just missed it. There we go, finish. Let's see, did I... I got a trophy. AOE Stage 1, Silver. Let's play the next one. There was a game on PlayStation 3. Forget who made it now. But it was a game called Shatter. And it was another, you know, single-player Pong-type clone. But the gimmick with that game was you, you can, you had a vacuum. Uh, I got sidetracked with my superpower there. Is yeah, you, you, your paddle had a vacuum on it, so you hit like the right trigger and you can push it. Oh, that threw me off. And then if you hit the left trigger you can pull it. So it kind of helped with that last ball situation where you can use the vacuum to help kind of aim a little bit better. It's hard to get the the power-ups when you still got to maintain the ball. But that's just what it is. Yeah, this game has a a paw theme, like the like the like a dog's paw. Like they're in the background right there. You can see them kind of rotating around. It was in the options menu too for some reason. Not sure why. 
Oh, hit the blue one. Just missed it. Oh. There we go. There it is. Finish. Got another trophy, AOA Stage 2. AOI, a name with all vowels in it. So the blocks that have, uh, yep, see, I was just gonna say, the blocks that have the. the gray, like, symbol on it, usually have power ups. going on here. I'm just going crazy, gotta just try to... There you go. Makes it a lot easier with that multi-ball. There you go, AOA Stage 3 trophy. Okay, so I beat all of AOE here. What pretty girl is next? What is this trophy thing up here? Oh, ranking. Let's see how I ranked. I don't know if I can find me, but... Oh, it just gives you the top ten? So there is online leaderboards. Alright, who's next? Nezuma. Alright, let's try Nezuma level one. Ready, go. Ooh, a bomb, a show. Nice bomb attack. Ah. This is what I'm talking about. This is how you make the game more fun. Add the ridiculousness to it. One left. There we go. Nice and quick. There, got another trophy. Nezuna Stage 1. Ready, go. Uh, these blocks you gotta hit a couple times. There we go. Nice shot. Nezuna Stage 2 Trophy. Ready. Go. Nice, I got that one ball up there, that was big. There we 
they go. Quick. They zoom at stage three. All right, let's try to get stage four. Man, if you get those power-ups, that's kind of the game-changer. And if you don't move right off the start, this is some easy points right here. And if I could get all the way up there and get whatever that item is... Oh, it's a longer stick. Perfect. So I just started, because I've been focusing so much on the game, the more blocks you clear, the different outfit appears on the lady off to the side. Like it kind of, you know, warps away. Okay. Yeah, I wanted to get the power up, but you can't risk it. Got it, okay. We just got the left side now. out to my favor. All right. <laughs> well, that made things easier right there. Okay. Stage select. So there, I just wanted to demonstrate some of the gameplay. Who's the next one? Sue... Sue Meyer? Sue Marie? Not sure how you say that. And then Tubaka? Tsubaka? And I can't play the unlocked Stage I'm gonna go back though, and I want to go to the dressing room. So here is a. Oh wait, how do I? Oh, so she's wearing like this robe thing. She's wearing this robe thing, and then this robe thing, and this robe thing. Here's number one. This, this, this. So she's in the same exact pose, just different outfits, and they're like not even that bad. It's not even like a crude. A lewd game, and then if you hit the triangle button, you can oh, you can scroll up or down now with the analog stick. Okay, and then you could zoom in with the, with the L and R buttons, and uh, yeah, there you go. So if you really wanted to look at a drawing of an anime, babe, this is as close as it gets. Here you go. 
So there you go. This is Pretty Girls Breakers. You can follow me on Twitter at Zach Gaz, Z A C K G A Z. I write for a site called MyGamer.com. Been writing for many, many years. It's, I think it's been close to 20 years at this point. Many news, reviews, streams, previews, and my personal blog is SquallSnake.com. If you wanted to click on that and support me there too, I appreciate you watching. And until next time, thank you for watching and game on.